one. We got some great eats for spring. Take a look at this salad right here. Perfect Balance Guru Pam Sherman joins us now. You're saying we need to focus on this this spring. If you want to start eating healthy, this is a way to do it. And it doesn't have to leave you empty afterwards. It does not. Now, I did not bring any protein, but okay. you want to have protein with every salad. Yeah. I heard a stat today. One out of every three Americans eat no fruits and vegetables. Yeah. I'm it's not, not hard. Let's make it easy. And, and it doesn't, okay. I mean, you can just grab some of this at the store. I mean, you don't have to have the fancy best of the best of the best, right? Mm -hmm. Romaine hearts, coleslaw right here. Yeah, the spring mix, Christopher's Crunch, Walmart, Trader Joe's. Yeah. It doesn't have to be one salad. You could, this is, this is all of this in a bowl, all chopped up with, you got to make it small so you don't have right? the leaves hanging out of your yeah, mouth. Yeah, <laughs> exactly. So these scissors, scissors are super handy. Yes. But I like what you have here. Explain your ratio okay. for what you put in a salad here. I think people try to overcomplicate eating healthy. My rule of three is going to be one fruit, mm -hmm. one nut, and one cheese. That's Simple. It. Simple. Three things. Three things. Ah, okay. So you have blueberries, you have raspberries. I like this little mixed nut medley here. And then you can chop them up too. Um, now, show us, when it comes to the dressing, yes. it's not a salad for me yep. unless it's drowned in dressing. Agreed. But it doesn't have to be unhealthy. It does not. Okay. Okay, so I make this at home all the time. This is, uh, we have almond milk at home. Okay. And I don't measure anything. A squirt of mustard, a squirt of garlic, some balsamic, some coconut aminos in my blender, and that's what this is. Now, some salads have yeah. these little packets in there. These are nice samples, I like to joke. It's a sample. Right? It's not enough. It's not enough. But you put that with all this other stuff in your blender, and you have a well-dressed salad. So you can take what sometimes is junk and make it, <laughs> I say that in the nicest way, yes, as yes. I'll still eat it. But it, you can turn it into something really good that makes this whole salad, because something like this isn't going to cover all of this, no. but you can augment it. Are those pistachios in there too? Pistachios, oh, blueberries, and goat so cheese. So good. They give such flavor. And then what's this here? Afterwards, okay. one of the things we talk about with salads is an hour later, you're still hungry, right? Right. What's this? Okay, so people love fruit salad. We have berries all yeah. over the place now, but you can eat a whole container and still be hungry. Right. Let's put some Greek yogurt with that and some almonds or whatever your favorite nuts are because you are going to stay full. That's a great dessert for yeah. any time this time of year. And this will hold you a little bit longer, yes. especially for kids. I notice when I give my kid uh, uh, non-fat Greek yogurt, his hunger doesn't last, or his hunger, you know, it, it holds it off at yep. bay. Pro, um, pomegranate seeds too. Oh, so good. Yes. So good. Okay, so it, it doesn't have to be hard. Rule of no. three, explain it one more time, Pam. One fruit, one nut, and one cheese, and whatever kind of lettuce you like. Yeah. Please, those little bag salads, that's not even, that's like yeah. half a serving. No. Let's eat And experiment. More. Sometimes I like this, sometimes I just cut up one of these and, and try that. And yep. then just, like I said, I make sure it has an easy dressing. And sometimes yeah. I thin it out, and sometimes I just dump it on there. It's a sample size. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> like that, it is a sample size. Pam, thanks so much for making sure we can stay healthy with beautiful looking salads like this one.